Cocoa Beach, Florida is located just one hour east of Orlando and is one of the most popular beach destinations from the Orlando area. We're starting our tour of Cocoa Beach, Florida at Port Canaveral. Port Canaveral is located just minutes from Cocoa Beach, Florida. And more than 4 million passengers pass through Port Canaveral every single year. And among them, some of the largest cruise ships in the world. Which, by the way, be sure to tell us in the comments section below what brings you to Cocoa Beach, Florida. Now, typically an interesting thing to do in Port Canaveral is to visit the iconic Exploration Tower. This tower looks like a giant sailboat and typically there are exhibits inside, although at the time of this video, this tower is closed for renovations. But it's still pretty cool to come over here and get some photos. One of the great reasons that so many people visit Cocoa Beach, Florida is because of the beaches. These beaches boast some of the whitest sand on Florida's east coast. One of the most popular beaches to visit in the area is the one next to the Cocoa Beach Pier. And the Cocoa Beach Pier is a pretty awesome destination in and of itself. It happens to be one of the coolest piers in all of Florida. On the pier, you'll find some great places to eat, and a couple of really neat places to shop. And not to mention some incredible views. As you can imagine, this beach typically gets filled up very quickly, especially the parking lot. So our family prefers to head over to the Lori Wilson Park. You'll get the same beautiful white sandy beaches with slightly less crowd and there's a playground nearby which is always a huge hit for our family. Now, while Cocoa Beach doesn't have great swelling waves, it's still the surf capital of the East Coast. It is home to the famous Kelly Slater, which is the reason that Cocoa Beach is home to the largest surf shop in all the world. This Ron John's boasts 52,000 square feet of retail space and is the flagship store for the entire chain. And even if you're not a surfing enthusiast, I think you're gonna find that a visit to this Ron John's is a one-of-a-kind experience. And if that's not enough beach-related retail space for you, there's even the Cocoa Beach Surf Company, which is located next door. Inside, you'll find even more beach gear. And there's a restaurant where you can dine with the sharks. Now, something that's easy to miss if you're not looking for it is that right across from Ron John's Surf Shop is Ron John's Beach Rentals Shop. And there, along with being able to rent some helpful beach gear like bicycles, surfboards, umbrellas, chairs, and so much more, you can also check out the free Florida Surf Museum. Today for lunch, we ate at Salsa's Mexican restaurant. and we had the fajitas for two, it was enough to feed our entire family. In the same vicinity as the Ron John Surf Shop, you'll find the Dinosaur Store. On the first floor of the Dinosaur Store is, of course, a store that's filled with fossils, gems, and lots of other very interesting dinosaur paraphernalia. Unfortunately, we're not allowed to video on the inside of the dinosaur store part because of the value of many of the things that are contained in there. Also on the first floor is an arcade and a few other fun family attractions. On the second story of the dinosaur store is a full dinosaur museum with all kinds of fossils and dinosaur bones. There's also a cave full of gems and stones from all around the world. The third floor of the dinosaur store is home to a couple of ancient civilization exhibits. One is an exhibit where you can learn all about ancient China. 
and the other an exhibit about ancient Egypt and a full replica of the tomb of Tutankhamun. One of our other favorite things to do in Cocoa Beach, Florida is to check out the very cool and quirky downtown Cocoa Beach. While this area is home to some of the city's municipal buildings, it's also the location of some very interesting and colorful murals. Here you'll also be able to enjoy a wide selection of shops, stores, and localized restaurants. There's also easy parking and easy beach access as well. Not far from Cocoa Beach is the town of Cocoa, Florida, and while it is a separate municipality, it's just a short drive over the bridge. In Cocoa, Florida, you'll find the historic Cocoa Village. This is another quaint Main Street downtown area. There's a beautiful waterside park. This park was a favorite for our children because there's a shady playground, which is always very helpful for both children and parents. And best of all, for those hot summer days, there's a free splash pad that you can visit. Once we finished enjoying the park, we were able to go to the nearby shops, stores, and restaurants. Our favorite was a barbecue restaurant, which we visited on that day. Cocoa Beach, Florida is located on Florida's beautiful Space Coast. And for even more great things to do all across the Space Coast, be sure to click this playlist right here. There are also lots of other great boat tours and excursions which can be taken from across this area. I'll place a link in the description to an article on our website which outlines even more great things that you can do in the Cocoa Beach area and provides links on Groupon for some of the best deals for those activities.